I'm so excited, it's so precious. It's our first stockings ever. Good morning, today is Tuesday. It is a week since we have been in this house and I'm about to head to the gym right now. It is like 10.30. I should get there at 11, but I have been chilling this morning and I have my Alani pre-workout. I'm taking Galaxy Lemonade with me and then I also have my little Starbucks cup. This is custom made by Butter Gloves underscore cups on Instagram. If you guys want to save and get yourself a custom cup, you can use code Libby10. It's my friend Haley's sister's business and she has stocked me up with all the cups that I could ever want. I just literally have them all over the house, but then for after my workout, I am going to head to Target because a lot of people were asking me on Instagram, since I have those little reindeer stocking holders for JJ and I, they are like, what about Bronx? I'm getting Bronx one from Target and a stocking from Target. The stocking is the same like fur, like color. It's like a very nice like beigey gray. And then for his stocking holder, I'm getting a little black paw print. Precious. So I'm also taking the Alani new peanut butter protein bar. If you guys do want to shop Alani, you can use code Libby. You get free shipping over $50 in the US. I'm wearing these sweats. These are from Happy Soul Sisters. Same place that I had that crew neck two videos ago. And then I have the, the little sports bra. I have this in a size small, the unbleached. It's perfect. And then I have the new Gymshark puffer jacket, which I'm obsessed with, especially with the colder weather. My space buns. And then I'm also wearing my Lane 8s. If you guys want to get yourself, I almost fell. If you guys want to get yourself some lane eights, use code Libby. You can also save with that. Um, but yeah, I will check back in with you guys. I hope you're having a great Tuesday or whatever day you're watching this. So far, this house is so empty, but we did get the TV mounted. I know I showed you guys yesterday, but this is what it looks like in daylight. I have a lot more things to get put in this space, but I'm excited about it. So I will check in soon. Okay, I am back home and sis kind of splurged at Target, so... I'm gonna let you guys know what I got. First of all, I got these two poofs. I thought that I would go well until I have like accent chairs in here with my couch. Um, my couch is like a white cream kind of color. Other than that, I got like just some stuff for the counters in here. Um, I got a jacket. I got Christmas pajamas for JJ Bronx and I. See, I was going to get the dog ones for Bronx, obviously, but they only had a size small. So I ended up getting him the toddler, like two year old size because I've put my Gymshark on him before and it fits him perfectly. So I decided to get him some real people clothes, um, but let me show you the rest of everything I got. Right, so my first item is just this like denim furry jacket. I actually got this from the men's section. This is a size medium, but cute, especially with this outfit, with my sweats and everything. It's oversized on me, I got a medium, so I really like it, and it's actually really, really warm. It's like fur all throughout here. Then there's a pocket right here, very nice. Cute with like some docks, and then let me show you. A lot of people were really worried that I didn't get Bronx, like a stocking holder and a stocking. I was waiting to go get this. I thought this would be perfect and it'll match my little reindeer that I have up there for JJ and I. Super freaking cute, this was like $10. And then I also got some beanies. So JJ has his dreads, you guys know, and he likes the beanies that are like a little bit longer. So I got this for him, I think it was, yeah, it was $10. Cute little knit beanie. And then also I got myself this mustard colored one because if you guys watched my vlog like one or two vlogs ago, you saw my Levi overalls and this is like a very similar color. How cute would it look with this and then some docks, black jeans, perfect. So I wanted to get a beanie for myself and y'all, I told you yesterday I was obsessed with the Myers cleaner. So I went ahead and got a couple of their hand soaps which um, they sell out so quick for their cleaners. So I got the soap. This one is the orange clove scent, and then this one is the peppermint scent. The peppermint, a lot of people told me was a really good scent, so I'm excited about that. This cutting board, we needed a cutting board, and y'all know that I'm like really into the woods in this room. I like the white woods and then neutral colors. So I got this, and then it has like the actual raw, like faux wood on the side, but we needed a good cutting board, so I was excited to get this. This wood circle, so I can put some things on here around holiday time, and I thought it would match the whole theme in here as well. Super cute. And then I also got these little houses. They're so cute. I figured I could put these like in my windowsill or something like that. This whole pack was like $5, which was awesome. And we all know that Libby loves candles. I got this one. It is amber, bergamot, and patchouli, scented candle with essential oils, coconut, and soy. I'm like 
really big on only using coconut and soy candles. My mom used to have a candle business when I was younger and this is the only kind she would let us burn. I do cheat a lot of the time, but I am making more of an effort to make sure I get the coconut or soy blend candles because it's better for you to breathe in and it's better for your house, it doesn't leave soot or anything like that. But this amber one smells super good and I love the container that it's in. You can see that it has the little amber and then the whole like engravement there. I got Bronx's little stocking, which I got JJ and I some that are like um, cable knit stockings from Crate and Barrel that I ordered. And I ordered Bronx's, but it looked more beige than gray, even though it was literally like called gray online. The photo just looked more beige and tan in color. So I actually picked that one up because I online ordered it and then I ended up not loving it as much and it was the same price as this one. And I thought like a furry one would be perfect for Bronx. So I'm excited about that. This will be on his little paw hanger on the mantle. Also for the TV in here that we mounted last night, I got a new Roku. I just have to get a power cord. For some reason, Target doesn't sell like individual power cords that's kind of weird but this was like $30 for a new Roku because we have the Roku TV upstairs this one is like it's older so I'm just gonna put it in the back of it so we can use it as well I got our pajamas so this one is mine you guys will catch JJ me and Bronx in here with our tree I was looking at trees at Target and a lot of them were so sold out so I'm going to go to Michael's and Home Depot to kind of check out what my options are because I think a lot of them do still have Black Friday sales this is JJ's and I was going to get Bronx like the little dog one, but they didn't have his size. So I got him the two year old one. How freaking cute. We're gonna be so precious on Christmas. I literally cannot wait. I'm so excited. But yeah, that wraps up my little Target haul. That's all the stuff that I got. I'm excited about it. I'm really ready for my couch to get here so I can kind of like assemble this area. It looks a little bare and bleak right now, but it is what it is. Gonna put these hand soaps in like our bathrooms around here and whatnot. I did get a really good workout in. I did a like arm upper body day that you guys will probably have already seen on Instagram. So make sure you guys go try that out because literally sis is swole. What? I was shook too, okay? But I'm gonna check back in with you guys in just a little bit when I do something a little bit more exciting. So freaking cute. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited and it's so precious. It's our first stockings ever. So cute. I can't take it. I'm about to try this because if it's bad, y'all, y'all will know. You can definitely taste the blue cheese, but it's not that bad. I would probably replace the blue cheese dressing with ranch and then just put blue cheese or feta crumbles on top, but it's not awful. It is pretty good. Hello, I'm over here in my coat because it's chilly in here and it's comfy. Somebody just told me they can't stop thinking about me being Frank Gallagher when I'm wearing this coat and I don't know how to feel about it, but I kind of like it because I love Shameless and Frank Gallagher, of course. But I have just been editing. I just finished uploading the video before this one or two before. I'm not really sure how long I'll make them um, to YouTube. So I'm going to set it live tomorrow morning. So you guys probably have already watched that. Hopefully you have. But JJ and I are going to have dinner a little bit later tonight. But I'm just going to be editing the next video. And then I'm going to do some homework. So it's a chill rest of the night. I have Lauren Geraldo on my YouTube on the TV. I love her so much, I don't know. I just literally love her. I love watching her videos. She's so entertaining and she's so cute. Now, we're gonna chill and I'm eating turkey bacon because I love turkey bacon so much. JJ ate all of the eggs and eggs are like one of my favorite snacks, but it's okay. morning guys so right now i am trying to pick an outfit i think that i'm going to put a poll on my instagram so over here i just have a cropped long sleeve like rib top and then i'm gonna layer that with this tupac top it's oversized and then i just have jeans and then docks and another pair of shoes or i might go with this outfit which is just all black so we have a black little turtleneck it's knit and ribbed so it's thick and then some distressed denim jeans and then the belt to go with each of these which one do you guys like best? I'm gonna ask on my Instagram, so whichever one I wear is the one that, you know, was chosen, but I would like to know your guys' opinion as well. Um, I'm about to hop in the shower, so I will check back in with you guys in just a second. So I'm currently plopping my hair. If y'all don't know what a plop is, I'll probably do a whole video on it when I do my entire like hair care routine, 
but I have a couple more minutes of this, but I'm gonna go do my skincare in the meantime. This really reveals how big my forehead is. Lordy, I have to expose it so I can put some product on it, but oh my goodness gracious. And now I do the only makeup that I ever wear, which is mascara. First, I use the Dime Beauty Volumizing Mascara, and then I go in with this second one, which is older. Um, it helps to like declump them. So this is the CoverGirl Flourish by Lash Blast. Now I am going to diffuse my hair. My hair is pretty much done drying, I would say. I'm just going to let it air dry for the rest of the day and it should be done sometime soon. And then for parting, I just let it live its best life, but I'm about to go get changed. All right, after I did my poll of which outfit I should do, the all black or the Tupac shirt, we are at Tupac is winning with 62% and then the all black has 38%. But I'm about to go put this outfit on real quick and I'll check back in. Okay, this is my fit. So this um, Tupac shirt is from Forever 21. I got it in a 2XL because they didn't have it in like a smaller size. So I figured I could just wear it oversized. And then these jeans are from Fit Jeans. They're really long. They're long enough for me. I love them. I'm wearing a size extra small, I believe, and then I have my docks on as well, and then this crop top. You guys saw it in another vlog, I believe, but it is from Forever 21 as well. I got these in separate orders right after one another, but my hair is starting to dry a little bit, and I'm actually about to head out of the house, gonna eat a little bit of food, but I have a nail appointment that I need to get to. Don't know what I'm doing, I never do until I get there, but I think I'm gonna do something almond-shaped, but we're going to see, so. This is the fit, this is the fit, this is the fit. I think this is cute, I don't know. I got Tupac on me, I mean, it has to be cute then. Um, but yeah, I feel like a little baggy in this. Let me know if you guys like it. If not, you'll see me in the other one soon. Decided I wanna try on these jeans with them instead. I don't know, I feel like these jeans are just so skinny jean-esque and like, I want it to be a little bit baggier. I don't really know. I'm going to try them on. I literally put on the wrong jeans the first time, which I'm just now noticing. I like these a little bit better. They have a little rip on the butt right there. But I feel like the washed jeans go better with this top. So I'm going to put my shoes on. Um, I don't know how I mixed that up. I grabbed the wrong jeans the first time around. So if you guys voted on this outfit, I'm glad because I have it on now. Now I have my shoes on. I think I like this better. I feel like these jeans go with this outfit better. I don't know how I switched those. So I did a good job at mixing them together and pairing it properly the first time that I laid out the outfits to take a picture. But now we're here and I like it. Hi, this is an emergency. I literally just tried to take a story of my outfit and um, I set it above the stove or oven right here and it fell behind there so I have to move this. I can hear my story playing right now. I am stressed. Wait a second. Uh, I don't know what to do. It's like a perfect fit between here. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. You get super strength when you're like stressed out. Oh my gosh, Libby. Only something I would do. Ugh. Not in here. Ugh. I got it. Oh. oh my gosh. Okay. I have learned right now to never put my phone right here to take a freaking story. So I am back from getting my nails done for a little bit. Tyra and I's appointments were lined up together. Mine was at 11.30 and hers is at 1.30. So I ran, grabbed some food, came back, chowed down a little bit with JJ. But these are my nails. This is what they look like. Don't mind my somewhat crusty cuticles, but I'm in love with them. They look so good. I love the whole like clear nail with something on top of it that's like been my vibe lately but this is what they look like and for anybody that's ever curious about my nails or like wants a photo of them i have a lot of you guys asking for like reference photos i always make reels of my nails so then you can just go pause that screenshot it and use that for reference but i am obsessed with them i love long nails i love almond nails and 
I'm very happy with them. If you guys are in the Kansas City, greater metro area, you can go to Gloss Spa. I go to Anne there. She's so cute. Um, and her tag on Instagram is Cosme Beauty. She does nails. She also does like lash extensions. She's also an esthetician. I'm going to go check her out and go to her for a little bit of my skincare. She is the best and she's super sweet and she is really like meticulous and wants to make sure everything looks great before she sends you away. But my nails are finished now. I think I'm going to do a little bit of content and then I'm going to drive back up to where Tyra's at at the salon. I love my outfit. If you guys saw this post on my story, I probably posted like a swipe of them on my feed already. But I hope you guys enjoy it. I took some selfies, which was crazy. Love that for me. So I just went live on Instagram for a while, streamed some of JJ's music, and we have Tyra back here. We are about to go shop and see if we can find some discount furniture and some more stuff for the house. <laughs> I want a discount on it. Um, but she just came over and we were both live for a little bit. But if you guys saw that, comment below a fairy emoji, I guess. I don't really know. But I will show you guys what I end up getting, if I end up getting anything. And then I think JJ and I are going to do dinner tonight, probably. But we'll see you guys in a little bit. All right, Tyra and I are back at the house. Listen, we were gone for a hot minute. We went to this one furniture store. Didn't find anything there. We were led astray. Also, their stuff was like cute, but not super cute and trendy. Um, then we went to Michael's and I actually got our Christmas tree finally. I got a seven and a half foot. It's pre-lit. I'm excited to put that up. I think I might save that for like a Vlogmas video. Depends how eager I am to put it up with JJ, but we got some ornaments um, and then all kinds of little like baby decor for the tree and around it. I still want to get a couple other things like a new tree skirt for it, but then we went to Chipotle to grab food. Where else did we go? Price oh, we went to Price Chopper so I can grab some organic ground beef so we can make some Rotel cheese dip tonight. Um, yes, I'm gonna eat Chipotle and the Rotel, of course. But I just came home to a new package Ooh, and stuffy. it seems like, <laughs> <laughs> it seems like this vlog is literally a repeat of a couple of them that you guys watched a couple days ago. But I got another one of my jackets. This is from Urban. I opened my blue one with you guys last time, but I got the little like lilac -y gray one. I will link it again. I've linked every single, I've linked three of them so far. So this will be in the description. I have this in a size small. I think it's worth it for the price. I obviously have four now. They're so comfortable and just so easy to throw on and pair with whatever you want. But now we're about to eat some foods. Michael's was just, Tyra knocked down frames. Yeah. I closed my eyes because I couldn't bear the sight. I was too afraid, I couldn't take it. It was all too much going on. But Tyra's over here smacking on her Chipotle and I'm jealous. So <laughs> I'm gonna eat mine and I will talk to you guys soon. JJ had his little boys over, all of his football boys, and they are upstairs hanging out right now. But Tyra just left, so I'm just chilling for the rest of the night, going to clean up a little bit. My turtleneck is having an issue, but it is what it is. I did order two more chairs. Um, they are the accent chairs that I've been kind of wanting. They aren't, I think they're the ones that are like most similar to what I want for a more affordable price. So they are from Target. They're the Sherpa ones. They are getting picked up by us tomorrow. So I will show you guys that either in this vlog or the next vlog. Make sure you stay tuned for it. Off to the gym. And I'm gonna go meet up with Tyra and then I just confirmed our delivery for our couch for Saturday But let's go. I am now home and I just got my Chairs in here. They are wrapped with saran wrap right now. So They are very cute, but they will look cuter once I have everything kind of put together But these are the Sherpa ones from Target and there was literally like two in the state of Kansas in the Kansas City metro area and I had to go to two different targets to go get them. I ordered them last night and then I picked them up today. JJ has a box of mine. And I'm excited because I can tell that they're already gonna warm up this space and make it more home-like. And then our couch gets delivered on Saturday. Bronx is throwing a tantrum because he's outside right now. But fun times. Now I have to unwrap those, but right now I have to go drop off the truck, grab my car, and then come back here and meet Tyra so I can go help her with some stuff. But Bronx is outside, waiting at the door. Do you see him? It's hot in here, so that box, I actually ordered a pottery wheel, a throwing wheel, 
um, because when I was in high school, I was obsessed with throwing. I made so many ceramics and I figured like with quarantine happening, it would help me to, you know, dive into another passion project of mine. So I'm really excited about that. But I have the chair set up right there. The couch is still not there yet, but she will be soon. Let me show you what it looks like from over here. Cute. I don't have the lights on in here because Bronx is checking it out. What do you think? You like them? I think that this will this will look good once we have the um, the coffee table in here as well as the couch. And the couch is a big L shape, like I mentioned before. But nice. It looks a little bit smaller here, but when you're looking at it from over in this area, that's what it looks like. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm very excited. I have to get out of here and skedaddle, but I will talk to you guys in just a second. This is what they look like right now. I had this ottoman and the, that ottoman that you guys saw in another vlog from Target. And then these chairs are also from Target, but just envision it. It's gonna be so cozy when it comes time for Christmas, when I have my couch here and everything, but they're perfect. And I love that the legs match the hardwood. Oh boy, there he is with his tug. He's gotta show it off. Okay, Tyra and I are back. We went to, where did we go? Oh, Diamonds Direct. She was doing a collab with them and I was helping her with like a reel and stuff. And then we just came home, we got some Panda Express because we wanted to get Chick-fil-A, but there were too many long lines at both the Chick-fil-A's that we went to. So we got Panda and I came home to a package and I don't know who this is from actually, but I think that they're flowers and it's just addressed to me, but it doesn't have anything else on here. Congrats on your new home. This is such an exciting moment. We're going to be working together and along for the ride. This is from Tula. Oh, oh, that's so cute. Lala. Oh my gosh. Two oh. bouquets. Oh, and the state flower of Kansas is a sunflower. So this is so pretty. Shout out to Tula.